Right guys, I'm with Michael and he's the artist for Headlocked. How are you doing Michael? Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. That's very good. So, uh, to start off with, can you tell us what, what the story all about? Ah, so Headlocked, The Last Territory, um, is about um, this guy, Mike Hartman, who drops out of college and decides to become a pro wrestler. Um, but he, he finds out very much the hard way that wrestling isn't as easy as he thought it was going to be. He goes through trials and tribulations, has uh, joints uh, dis dislocated and whatnot. He gets tortured and stretched out and beaten up um, in his pursuit to become a pro wrestler. So with that, um, have you taken any inspiration from real life? Like, are you, like you've got the mask yeah. ready. <laughs> have I taken, uh, yeah, well funnily enough, uh, not only am I a comic book artist, I'm also a pro wrestler in New Zealand. Uh, so yeah, so that's why I'm wearing the mask. Um, actually, I think I've been featured on Australian television. Um, so New Zealand, uh, there was a wrestling uh, television series that was filmed in New Zealand for the Maori television uh, channel. And I think it was, it was screened here on uh, the Aboriginal channel. I'm not too sure what it was, because uh, I've had friends comment saying, hey, I saw you on TV uh, in Australia. So, uh, so yeah, so uh, my experience as a pro wrestler really comes into play when, uh, when I'm drawing the comic, because uh, all the action, uh, all the little bits and pieces when it comes to wrestling, uh, I make sure it's legit so that other wrestlers can read the book and, uh, and see that I, we know what we're, we're doing and we really respect the art of pro wrestling. So yeah, so, uh, so, yeah, so my, my experience as a pro wrestler really does come into play. Oh yeah, <laughs> so, so you can use all the terminology and everything? And, and yep, uh, yeah, so, yeah, so there'll, there'll, be, there'll be some like terminology in there uh, that is very much part of pro wrestling, but there's also um, a lot of like uh, showing, uh, because the reader is pretty much learning along with the main character, Mike Hartman. So we're also kind of breaking down little bits and pieces of wrestling so that while Mark Hart Mike Hartman is learning it, so, the, so is the reader as well. So, um, so yeah, so little things like that because of my experience, I, I, can, uh, I can illustrate that uh, in the right way. And I've had so many great feedback from, um, from WWE superstars and TNA superstars and stuff uh, who have read the book and absolutely love it because they're like, man, Know, you guys know what you're doing is like that's because I respect pro wrestling and so I want that to come through in the book. So you would say it's very relatable for those who want to go down this path? Well yeah um, in, in the end it's pretty much a comic about pro wrestling it's not a pro, like there's a lot of pro wrestling in it so those who may not be into pro wrestling can still get into it because the story is freaking awesome um, but those who love wrestling get a bit of an insight into the business um, and so yeah so it's, it's, it's fantastic yeah. So with your own history, uh, Michael, how did you get into comics? How did I get into comics? Man, I've been reading comics since I was five. Um, and so pretty much reading comics at such a young age and loving to draw, all I ever wanted to do was draw comic books. Um, and so I'm very fortunate enough to have worked really hard and got great opportunities and capitalized on those to become a comic book artist now and, uh, and do conventions like Oz Comic Con here in Sydney. And uh, I'm doing Brisbane next week as well. So. Um, so yeah, and I'm doing New York Comic Con in October. So, um, so yeah, so yeah, pretty much comics have just been a part of my life, like ever since I could like read, pretty much. So, awesome. Yeah. Uh, do you have anything for the future? Any plans for that in regards to drawing more? Oh uh, yeah, no. So I'm currently working on some more headlock stuff. Um, so yeah, so there's constantly some headlock stuff. Um, the latest headlock stuff I'm working on, I just finished uh, illustrating a story with MVP. Um, Samoa Joe and the Young Bucks, uh, um, we're doing a story with them. Uh, the next volume of Headlock, we still have to like 100% confirm, but we have Rey Mysterio doing a story, Mick Foley doing a story, Zack Sabre Jr. and possibly Cody Rhodes doing stories for uh, for the book. So yeah, so like this current this current um, version here, which is the Kickstarter special edition, which has wrestler content. This, uh, this book here actually has a backup story by AJ Styles and uh, a pin-up by Booker T and Tony Atlas. So yeah, so it's crazy. I get to meet wrestlers through the comic book um, and hang out with them, so it's crazy. Hey Michael, we hope to hear yeah. more good news and it looks like it's, you're on the path of success anyway, so it's fantastic. Great no, to hear. No, thank you, for, uh, thank you for interviewing me. Thank you for having me. Yeah. Thank you very much. Sweet. Have a good one. Cheers. Catch it.